I think basically this is the first game, first competition for them. Um, they started about almost four months ago. Yeah, and uh, they actually start with zero, zero level, which means there's no experience at all. So we put them on the skates and then put on gears for them and uh, let them start training. We, the first uh, very important training is the basic skating. Basic skating is very important because uh, without the basics, they can never get up to the next level. So uh, for almost two months, they managed to get their basic skating done. And then later on, then we work, we work on the uh, stick. We work with them, we put a stick on their hand and they start you know, getting used to it and plus skating together. So um, from last week's uh, observation, I think they are able to handle the stick and able to skate. I think for the, uh, the pre players, in fact, um, they're going to have a lot of uh, surprise, surprise because they're going to use the big ice. So normally we use uh, half an ice for practice, so they're going to skate harder today. And of course, uh, it's going to be faster, the game is going to be faster and you have some high level player play against them. Yeah, and uh, a lot of players have uh, what you call game fright. So they might have the same feeling, but I'm going to put somebody in the team there as a team manager to boost their confidence level up. Okay, uh, because a lot of things change since their training. We would like to see more of uh, the special people playing sports, especially playing ice hockey. Um, like I mentioned earlier last time, um, in sports there's no boundary and we'd like to see them coming more often and uh, we will try to blend them with people who can hear with hearing, uh, don't have this sort of disability and uh, when they can play much better, uh, we will sort them out into let's say for instance two special players into one team so that uh, in a way the players can also learn how to you know communicate with them and in a way they also will be learning something uh, something new a new language you see well definitely we're going to continue uh, putting them more in the training currently now they come for the learn to play program uh, they have to really um, improve on their skating skill as well as uh, other skills like uh, park handling, the sorting. And uh, they, they will be coming more often and uh, by the time when they are going to different stages, uh, because in Learn to Play we have few stages, you know. So when now they are in the basic one and then once they know how to handle certain skating skills better, they will be moving further up. And uh, maybe later on we will put them into playing the local league. Hello